Hopefully he's regular and not the bad shit. Why can't you just loosen up and live a little? <laughs> just helping you out. I don't need help. I need a drink. Ooh, spicy tonight. I like it. But at least let me better. Why can't you let us like me for who I am? Oh, come on. Nobody likes anybody for who they are. That's why we have to make out that we're better than who we are and let people find out the truth later when they're already invested. It's like, it's like the girl is a genius. Finally, you like me, Sheen? I think you're nice. Please scream, get off that stage and take me now. Yes, but not in a good way. How could it not be in a good way? I don't, I don't get why everyone acts like sex is such a big deal. It's like a national obsession and epidemic. It's because sex is freaking fantastic. It's not that great. I mean, the kissing part may be, but the main event is that thing that the guys test about. Yes! I knew it! I win! I knew you weren't a virgin! What do you mean you win? You win what? No big deal. Just a bet with Dougie. Hey, Dougie! You want your coffee? No, wait, Gary, you can't. <laughs> All right, fine. So I've had sex, and I still don't get why people ruin their lives for it, like lie and cheat and hurt people. Is that why you wear those man shirts? What man shirts? Like you always wear. And God forbid anyone see your shape. Can we stop joking about my shape? Look, the problem is you haven't had sex with the right person. There's a lot of good, clean sex out there, and by clean, I mean dirty. And just because people like to do it doesn't mean they're obsessed. I mean, are people sleep obsessed because they like to sleep every day? That's different. You have to sleep for survival. Some people screw for survival. Survival of the species, for one thing. Sleep session doesn't hurt anyone. Neither does sex, if it's between two consenting adults. Look, some Victorian Quaker assholes forced everyone to deny their natural urges, and the fallout is a world of Prozac zombies. Should natural desire sometimes be denied? But if your natural desire is is to step on a baby. Okay, I agree there. Stepping on babies should be avoided at all costs. I, I just think people use an awful lot of excuses to indulge in the bad behavior on the pretext that they want to do it. I'm only human, blame it on uh, alcohol. If we're discreet, no one will get hurt. I think we're pretty close. Yes, we are. And that is what makes us so flipping interesting. What is the truth? What is this? Is this a bucket list? Oh my god, you're not dying, are you? Because I don't have the emotional maturity for a terminal friend right now. No, dude, it's, it's not a bucket list. Then what is it? Okay. I'll get it out of you. I'm very tenacious. She was a therapist. She made up a list to help me be happier. Oh, honey, you don't need a list for that. I'll help you. But first off, having a New Year's Eve party, you should come. Then you should call that guy from the paper, give him the bang of his life, He'll leave that twitties with, and you'll never be lonely again. You seriously think that? Look, you don't have to be everyone's moral guardian. If you like the guy, that's between you and him. He's the one with the fiancé, not you. It's for him to deal with. 